Hello there, all you beautiful thrill seekers. My name is Ghost Shadow Stubborn, but built for theme parks, and welcome to Ghost Chat YouTube channel. <laughs> Hello there, guys. My name is Ghost Shadow Stubborn, but built for theme parks, and welcome to a theme park newsroom update where today. We're going to be looking at the latest construction on the Jersey Devil Coaster, the brand new Rocky Mountain Construction Single Rail Roller Coaster opening at Six Flags Great Adventure in 2021. This is a brand new project, delayed through 2020, and we have more construction officially released by the, the park. Uh, this is the first Jersey, Jersey Devil construction update of 2021. You go check out. Uh, previous ones that we've uploaded over the channel over the recent months, so please go check them out. Uh, but for now, guys, before we get started, make sure you like the video if you've loved it. Comment down below your thoughts and opinions on the latest construction. Subscribe to the channel, click the OK bell so you never miss another thrilling YouTube video. Also, guys, make sure you go check out the latest videos we've uploaded. We've uploaded a review from the Skyride at Alton Towers, an update on the brand new Museum of Making in Derby uh, opening this spring, so make sure you go check that out. And uh, check out more videos as well. We've got some more content coming on the way as well. Can't wait like to share you with you what that is. Also, guys, if you go to the description down below, you can not only find Great Adventures uh, Twitter post officially linked in the description down below, but you can also find links to Twitter, TikTok, Instagram, and Snapchat for the channel. So please, please, please get in there and get following. Also, you can check out where you can submit your own video ideas. So if you think you've got an idea for a video uh, for the channel or anyone you want me to interview as part of the Coast Child Chat series, then get it in the Google Forms link in the description down below. And all video ideas have been saved so far and are ready to be pre-recorded in the summer. And for now, guys, let's have a look at the latest construction on Jersey Devil. So this is officially from Great Adventures Twitter. Again, that's linked in the description down below. Uh, track installation this week includes the drop after the block breaks, an overbank turn, and the start of Airtime Hills Galore, officially said by the part. Now, of course, from the official pictures, you can clearly see the work is still progressing amazingly. A uh, brand new piece of track ready to be installed, and overall, this is going to be a wonderful new roller coaster for the theme park. I mean, this is going to literally start breaking records. This, this is breaking records. This is literally breaking records, guys. And uh, now for those of you who are new to the channel and have absolutely no idea what this coaster is or what the stats are, we have a length of 3,000 feet. So it is a custom layout, the first custom Raptor track in the world. A height of 130 feet, a speed of 58 miles per hour. Three inversions, an 87 degree vertical angle, and we have a dive loop, a zero G stall, a zero G roll, and as well as the chain lift hill and the block break. So overall, Jersey Devil is a one of a kind. And from the latest construction from the park today, we can see that work is really progressing on this smooth, devilish attraction. So there we go, ladies and gentlemen, thrill seekers of all ages, that is your Jersey Devil construction update. Now to share my thoughts on latest construction, I love it. I absolutely love how quick the process is going, I love how quick the construction's going with this. You saw the photos uh, of the construction of the ride at the moment, and it's amazing. It's really, really coming along brilliantly, and uh, hopefully a summer 2021 opening isn't completely out of the question. Um, Jersey Devil really is a devilish ride and you know Jersey Devil at uh, uh, Six Flags Great Adventure the parks really progressed this so well and the parks hyped this attraction up ever since we started covering this rumoured attraction back at the start of uh, or around the 2020 um, well around 2019 sorry um, we knew something was coming we knew something big was being announced for 2020 and of course that would now become a 2021 attraction um, and, you know, we followed the teasers, we followed the marketing campaign for this, we followed the rumours, we were we were rumouring all kinds of stuff, you know, is there an RMC going into El Toro's plot of land or near El Toro, you know, is it going to be somewhere else in the park, what's going to happen, Looney Tunes Seaport then got, is getting taken out for this, it's, it's an old kids area, 
Um, you know, in my opinion, 2022, I think Six Flags Great Adventure will end up, you know, refurbishing one of their current kids' area. Remember the Bugs Bunny National Park into Bugs Bunny Boomtown uh, would be the case. So I think that 2022 is inevitable, in my opinion. I think a kids' area will come into Six Flags Great Adventure uh, next season in 2022. But I think for a thrill attraction, we are looking at a brilliant attraction here. And I think that, you know, the best way to take out a kid's area for a coaster is to bring in something like Jersey Devil. I think, you know, Six Flags Magic Mountain finally isn't adding the first custom Raptor for Six Flags. It's actually Great Adventure. And uh, you know what? Excuse me. The, I, 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 in my opinion, I think Great Adventure did well with this. I think that, you know, overall, I, I, I do personally believe that... Um, you know, Six Flags Great Adventure getting the first custom layout Raptor Coaster, not the prototype, over Magic Mountain was a great shout for the park originally. Uh, especially since Great Adventure, you, you, you know Great Adventure, you know, they hadn't had a custom from scratch coaster in so many years, ever since El Toro probably. So, you know, even though they had, you know, Green Lantern in 2011 and, you know, they had the Joker, which is like, yeah, you sort of cookie cutter coaster, it's the same layout as every other 4D free spin in the Six Flags chain. Uh, so they were quite cloned coasters, but in terms of custom from scratch coasters, there hadn't been one thrilling wise since El Toro. So it was inevitable that Six Flags Great Adventure would be next in line for a roller coaster. And to get one of these custom Raptors over Magic Mountain, yes, Magic Mountain are going to get one in 2022 uh, to replace Green Lantern First Flight and the Tidal Wave. Uh, but I tell you what, for Great Adventure to get one over Magic Mountain is brilliant. It shows the Great Adventure is getting the right investment at the right time. Um, I think there'll be other stuff they'll do over the next few years before they get their next coaster. Uh, things like the kids area, new flat rides, new shows, maybe to bring back the crowds into the entertainment point of view uh, after COVID goes away and leaves our lives for good, hopefully, uh, very, very soon. Um, but for a thrill attraction, right place, right time, and Jersey Devil's the right attraction. And from the latest construction, it's really picking up the pace on site. Uh, loads of track delivery, loads of track being put up, different sections being completed, and hopefully in the next week we'll get another update and we'll see uh, more stuff being completed with the coaster. So, very exciting stuff from Six Flags Great Adventure, and it's a very, very devilish ride. Thank you so, so much, guys, for watching this theme park news update on Six Flags Great Adventure's brand new coaster for, that, uh, for this year, Jersey Devil Coaster. Thank you very much, guys. Make sure you like, comment, subscribe. And for now, my name is Coaster Chow, keep living the coast life, and I'll see you guys in the next video very, very soon. Take care, guys. Have a devil-tastic day.